Hello everyone, I am Renown Zero. We are back yet again talking about Marvel Studios revealing the release date and casting of the Fantastic Four, which includes the recently rumored Pedro Pascal playing Reed Richards. Now this is of course Ray swapping the character because Reed Richards is indeed a white guy and Pedro Pascal is Chilean. This comes to us from Fandom Pulse. Marvel Studios has set a fresh release date for the Fantastic Four, now scheduled for July 25th, 2025. Alongside this announcement comes the revelation of the cast, headlined by Pedro Pascal as Reed Richards, Vanessa Kirby as Sue Storm, Evan Moss Bachrock as Ben Grimm slash The Thing, and Joseph Quinn as Johnny Storm. Marvel enthusiasts received this news with a buzz of excitement, but there's no confirmation yet on the rumors about a sex-swapped Silver Surfer. The announcement was made through Marvel Studios' official social media channels featuring a poster that embraced the romantic vibes of Valentine's Day. You can see the poster here with, of course, Pedro Pascal's face on as Reed Richards, Sue Storm, Johnny Storm, and The Thing. The poster not only showcases the primary cast with Pedro Pascal, but also includes the beloved robot Herbie, and a nostalgic nod to Ben Grimm's pre-superhero days as a NASA astronaut. This poster served as a concrete confirmation of the long-awaited casting decisions. Speculation regarding the casting of the Fantastic Four has been rampant in the Marvel fandom, with enthusiasts eagerly anticipating who would embody these iconic characters. The confirmation of Pedro Pascal's involvement adds another feather to his cap, following Pedro Pascal's performances in various productions like The Last of Us, The Mandalorian, and Game of Thrones. The Fantastic Four is positioned as part of Phase 5 in the MCU, or MCU at, at this point. The project has been in development for some time with Matt Shockman attached as the director and a team of writers tasked with shaping the script. The film is expected to draw inspiration from unexpected sources, including the humor of It's All so Always Sunny in Philadelphia. The casting choices reflect a blend of established talent like Pedro Pascal and new stars Vanessa Kirby, known for her performance in projects like The Crown and Mission Impossible, Bringing her acting skills to the role of Sue Storm slash The Invisible Woman. Yvonne Moss, Bachrock, recognized for his work in the series like The Bear and The Punisher, steps into the shoes of Ben Grimm slash The Thing, and Joseph Quinn, known for his role in the hit series Stranger Things, embodies the fairy, fiery spirit of Johnny Storm, the Human Torch. Marvel Studios' decision to swap release dates between the Fantastic Four and Thunderbolts is probably the result of the Thunderbolts project having just lost another actor in A.O. Eddie Beery. I you say that? Created by Stanley and Jack Kirby back in 20, 19, uh, 1961, the Fantastic Four characters have captured the imaginations of audiences for decades. The journey to bring the Fantastic Four to the MCU has been marked by various attempts, including previous adaptations by other studios. However, with Disney's acquisition of 21st Century Fox, a door opened for these iconic characters to join Marvel Studios. With Vanessa, um, with Pedro Pascal, Vanessa Kirby, Ivan Moss, Bachrock and Joseph Quinn leading the charge in the Fantastic Four. Audiences are hopeful for an exhilarating adventure that stays true to the spirit of the beloved Marvel characters. Only time will tell. So that would be completely up to the writers, knowing what they're doing, knowing if they ever read a Fantastic Four comic and know who these characters are that were created by Stan Lee and Jack Kirby. But knowing Disney's track record, they'll somehow find a way to screw it up, even though they've managed to closely hire white people to play these roles as they should because you're basing your movie on source material that has been well established for multiple decades there shouldn't be any reason for you to race swap these characters when you can just simply find the best people for the job that know the material of these characters and put give them writers that know the material of these characters so we'll just have to wait and see how this all pans out Thank you all for checking out this video. Really do appreciate all the new subscribers, returning subscribers, new viewers, returning viewers. If you do like this video, hit the like button. Comment below if you feel about all this. Subscribe for more content like this and hit the bell for notifications. Set the bell to all. That way you'll get a notification anytime I post a new video or live stream. And I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.